Moving to Aotearoa has actually got me more in touch with my own papa. And, you know, when I first arrived, I, you know, found myself remembering wisdom from my parents. It's the weirdest thing. One of the things my dad taught me was, you know, when I'm walking on the street, not to be too obsequious in terms of making way for others. Obviously be polite, but he observed me once and he said, you know, like, don't do that. You don't need to do that stepping aside for anyone. So I'm, I'm that kind of person anyway. I'm very sensitive and very, my proprioception is heightened, I think, because I'm an ex-dancer. But I think that was something that's really stayed with me. I do often wonder why I hold my head up high despite having lived through quite a lot of racism in 1980s Britain when I was very little and that stuff would have been going in and creating the blueprint of who I am. And somehow I've managed to avoid the worst of it.